brothers and sisters in Islam. If a person lives life with death in mind, meaning with the hereafter in mind, what will they ultimately be working for then? They will be working for something which is everlasting, not something which is temporary. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala speaks of this world in a temporary language. He says, وَمَا الْحَيَاةُ الدُّنْيَا وَمَا الْحَيَاةُ الدُّنْيَا إِلَّا مَتَاعُ الْغُرُورِ And this world, this hayat al-dunya, this life of this dunya, the life of this dunya, dunya comes from the root word dana'a or daniya, which means low life, not worth anything, insignificant. The life of this insignificant world is nothing but two things. Mata' and ghurur. Mata' means temporary enjoyment. Ghurur, deception. So the entertainment is temporary. And not only is it temporary, it's also deceiving. It's not even real. So you know when we hear it, when we talk about the hereafter, to us now it seems like a dream, a fantasy, something which is, uh, we don't get affected by it because it's not right now. But Allah is telling us it's actually the opposite. You're going to feel in the hereafter that this world that you actually saw as reality, this was the fantasy. This was the imaginary world. This was the thing which was, was just a dream. And truly, it will be like that.